Tailed Beast The Tailed Beasts, Biju, sometimes referred to as Chakra Monsters, Chakura no Bake Mano, are the nine titanic living forms of chakra created by the Sage of Six Paths out of the chakra from the Ten Tails. They are differentiated by the number of tails they have, ranging from one to nine. History Long before the founding of the Hidden Villages, the Sage of Six Paths saved the world by sealing the Ten Tails into his body, becoming its Jinchuriki. Some time later, the Sage was inspired by his youngest son, Azura, to use his creation of all things ability to divide the Ten Tails Chakra into nine living entities, what would become the Tailed Beasts. The Sage named the nine and explained to them that a link existed between them despite their separation. He also foretold of a day when they would be brought together again, though not as they were, and that at that time someone would emerge to show them what true power is. In the anime, it was shown that before his death, the sage and his followers built temples in nine different regions of the world where the tailed beasts could live and be protected. The tailed beasts were originally created not only to prevent the ten tails resurrection, but also to maintain and balance peace. The first person to come close to their original usage was Hashirama Senju, who had captured several of the tailed beasts with his wood release, distributed the beasts amongst the new villages in order to stabilize the balance of power between them. However, Hashirama's usage of the tailed beasts were forceful rather than earning their willful cooperation. This method would be realized in Hashirama's successor as Azura's reincarnation, Naruto Uzumaki. Over the centuries, humanity failed to recognize the tailed beasts as sentient individuals, instead seeing them only as demons, malignant spirits, or mindless beasts worthy of fear and disdain. Because of their immense power, the tailed beasts were sought out by humans to be used as weapons in times of war. The beasts resented this treatment and came to hate humans, at times willingly becoming the monsters they were viewed as. In order to harness the beasts' power, the villages began sealing them into humans, creating their own Jinchuriki. Decades later, after the Third Shinobi World War, an organization known as Akatsuki begins capturing the village's Jinchuriki in order to extract their tailed beasts and seal them into the demonic statue of the Outer Path for the purposes of reviving the Ten Tails. By the time of the Fourth Shinobi World War, Akatsuki has captured the first seven tailed beasts. In order to capture the last two, the Eight Tails and Nine Tails, Tobi seals the beasts back into their reincarnated Jinchuriki and forces them to fight the Eight Tails and Nine Tails Jinchuriki. Killer B and Naruto Uzumaki, respectively. From Naruto's determination to free them from Tobi and his desire to learn their names, the tailed beasts collectively decide that Naruto is the person the Sage of Six Paths foretold of. They give him portions of their chakra, enabling him to release them from Tobi's control. Tobi is able to reclaim the freed tailed beasts and, using fragments of the Eight Tails and Nine Tails chakra, to prematurely revive the Ten Tails. Tobi then becomes the Ten Tails Jinchuriki, but he is defeated by the allied shinobi forces and the Tailed Beasts are removed from his body. The Nine Tailed Beasts join forces against Tobi's co-conspirator, Madara Uchiha, but he quickly defeats them all and seals them, including the Eight Tails and Nine Tails, into the demonic statue and reforms the Ten Tails yet again. Madara becomes the Ten Tails Jinchuriki and attempts to use infinite Tsukuyumi on the world. Naruto uses the Tailed Beast's earlier donations of chakra to try and defeat him, but is unable to do so in time. Madara is afterwards unwittingly used to restore Kagaya Atsutsuki, who tries to take what portions of the Tailed Beast's chakra Naruto still has. In one of Kagaya's dimensions, Naruto and Sasuke Uchiha seal Kagaya away and the Tailed Beasts are extracted from her body, ending the war. Sasuke, however, realizing that the struggle for the Tailed Beasts started the war in the first place, imprisons them with Chibaku Tensei and intends to kill them so the world can't fight over them any longer. Naruto convinces him not to in the end and the Tailed Beasts are finally released for good. The Tailed Beasts spread out through the world, free to live as they want, both Gyuki and Kurama decide to return and stay with B and Naruto. However, though they are apart, the Tailed Beasts' chakra fragments remain within Naruto, allowing his body to act as their meeting ground. Fifteen years after the Fourth Shinobi World War, during the investigation of the Atsutsuki clan to find out Kagaya's final fate, two of them began to chase the tailed beasts in order to claim their chakra, starting with Gyuki and Kurama. While Mamashiki Atsutsuki and Kinshiki Atsutsuki were initially successful in steal an amount of the powers of the respective beasts by capturing their Jinchuriki, both ended up being killed by being dominated by the combined power and effort of the five Kage, Sasuke and Boruto Uzumaki. Sometime after the defeat of Mamashiki and Kinshiki, when Yurashiki Atsutsuki began targeting Shikaku for its chakra, it was deduced he was also interested in all the tailed beast's chakra. 
Naruto then organized a telepathic meeting with the other tailed beasts, except for Matatabi, Kokuo, and Komiai, who each refused to accept aid from humans in fear of being captured and used again by them, despite their trust in Naruto, and thus decided to skip the meeting. With the final defeat of Urashiki, the beasts that were being kept safe presumably returned to be free to go their own way. Abilities Tailed beasts are widely believed to be bestial in nature, incapable of the intelligence needed to fully utilize their immense strength. It is thought that only when sealed within humans are they able to benefit from the knowledge of their Jinchuriki to use their powers effectively. Though this is not true of the divided tailed beasts, the Ten Tails does make more wanton use of its powers, not focusing its abilities to the most advantageous end until sealed into a Jinchuriki. Each of the tailed beasts have their own unique abilities, but they all share the same core attributes, they have massive quantities of powerful chakra, colored red, far greater than what most shinobi have, can easily transfer their chakra to whomever they choose, and can use the tailed beast ball. Because the tailed beasts are pure chakra, they cannot permanently die, if they or their jinchuriki die, their chakra will reform in time. In addition, if a large portion of a tailed beast's chakra is separated from it, that chakra becomes a separate, sentient copy of a tailed beast. However, if a tailed beast uses a life-sacrificing power-up such as Baryon Mode, it will have its physical form destroyed and die. In this case, the death of the tailed beast will not endanger the life of its Jinchuriki. It is also pointed out that consuming the flesh of a tailed beast is usually deadly for anyone, unless the person is somehow descended from the Sage of Six Paths, in this case, the person will gain abilities similar to a Jinchuriki. Tailed beasts can communicate telepathically with one another and their Jinchuriki, and possess several levels of consciousness. In the initial level, the beast appears to be in a habitat of sorts, typically imprisoned in some way by whatever Fuinjutsu was used to seal them. The second level is where all the tailed beasts can convene and communicate with one another, free of any restrictions. Jinchuriki are also able to enter this level, but in order to do so, they must be completely linked with their tailed beasts. A freed tailed beast can continue communication with their former Jinchuriki, even years after separating. Although only shown with Kurama, a tailed beast will become unconscious if they have lost all of their chakra, by either using it, or having it drained from them. It has been shown that tailed beasts can have more than one conscience or body, as in the fourth great ninja war and onwards, Shikaku to Komiai are present in the real world, and Gyuki was inside Killer B, while all eight were inside Naruto as well, where they hold meetings. The Tailed Beasts The Tailed Beasts in order of their number of tails. Shikaku Matatabi Isabu Son Goku Kokuo Saiken Komiai Yuki Karama Ten Tails If you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you later, bye bye.